Dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to tell you something. Please watch video completely and sit with copy pen. And if you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. If you find anywhere some problems or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share, and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Now here is the question. When water is filled carefully in a glass, one can feel it to a height h above the rim of the glass due to the surface tension of water. To calculate h just before water starts flowing, model the shape of the water above the rim as a disk of thickness h having semicircular edges as shown schematically in the figure. When the pressure of water at the bottom of the disk exceeds what can be withstood due to the surface tension, the water surface breaks near the rim and water starts flowing from there. If the density of water, its surface tension and the acceleration due to gravity are 10 raised to power 3 kg per meter cube, 0.07 Newton per meter and 10, uh, and 10 meter per second square respectively. Then, what is the value of H in mm? This question is asked JE Advanced 2020. And uh, this question is totally based on Young's Laplace pressure law. Young's Laplace pressure law is based on excess pressure inside the curved surface. Here, when water poured in a cylindrical container, then that is raised some level and after it became to leakage. At the moment, we have to find out the value of H. Let us consider this bulge is formed like this bangle type design and this radius of this curvature is R1 and whole radius, you can consider this is two type of curvature, first radius this bulge and upper view, you can see that the circular, this radius is R2, the radius of the cylinder. So here, H R1 is equal to H by 2. Okay. Total height is H and exactly middle part you can consider that is R1. So R1 equal to H by 2. Clear? So here R1 is less than less than R2. Then what is the inverse, uh, inverse relation? 1 by R1 is greater than greater than 1 by R2. So now using this Young's Laplace formula. Excess pressure, excess pressure is E means surface tension 1 by R1 plus 1 by R2. Here pressure, excess pressure you know that H rho G equal to surface tension T 1 by R1. What is R1? Here R1 is H by 2. And 1 by R2 can be neglected because 1 by R1 is greater than greater than 1 by R2. So therefore become 0. Now H rho G equal to T 2 by H. Here H square equal to 2T by rho G. Okay. Now it is the formula. Now substitute the value of surface tension. What is the value of surface tension? It is 0.07. What is the value of rho? 1000. And acceleration due to gravity is 10. Now h equal to, removing this decimal, then become 1, 1, 2, means 100. 7 twos of 14, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10, this 4, 6. Now h equal to root 14. Its value is approximately 3.74 and 10, this 4, 6, its root now it become 1000. It is in meter, but we have to ask h in millimeter. So multiply by 1000, then 3.74 mm, it is the correct answer. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of the video. And I remind you, those who have not subscribed yet, do it immediately by pressing bell icon. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.